Alaska's World War II and Korean War veterans gathered at the Anchorage International Airport this morning as part of Honor Flight 2015. KTVA photojournalist John Thane was there for the emotional send-off. Well, right now we're uh, mobilizing our 23 veterans and guardians, 13 World War II, uh, 10 Korean War vets, and then each will have a guardian. It looks like a, a very favorable crowd to me. This is wonderful. They're taking this many old people, let's say, old uh, soldiers, or whatever you want to say, <laughs> on this flight. And uh, my grandson is with me to take care of me. I've been to Washington, but not to the memorial. Yes, and that's what I'm looking forward to. We'll hit all the memorials. We'll hit the World War II, Korean, Vietnam, Lincoln, Iwo Jima, the Ladies Memorial, the changing of the guard. I've always had uh, deep respect for the tomb of the unknown soldier. And I want to be there, hopefully, at the changing of the guard. I'd like to see that. It is one of the most blessed things that we as a nation can do is to appreciate those that have gone before us to give us our freedom. It's just really a neat recognition for them to finally get to go see uh, something that honors their hard work and dedication and uh, years of service. So I should really appreciate it. And I went last October on this trip and I'll tell you it's the most wonderful thing that ever happened to us. Good. I very much want you to know how much I appreciate what you have gone through, what you put yourself through, what you volunteered for. Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. You guys made me know what the national anthem really meant. Yeah. All my life I've been singing and it was the start of a program. Three years ago when I first started singing at the honor flights, I looked into you guys' eyes and I've never sang it the same. Sounding great tonight. The veterans will spend the next five days traveling to Washington, D.C., where they will experience the monuments built to remember their sacrifice.